Megan Shaw. Megan, um, a really good start to your collegiate career. Uh, let's go back to the indoor. You won uh, the 400 indoor um, in the Southern Conference. Uh, you know, as a true freshman coming out of Pineville, what, how do you think you've adjusted to college track and what's allowed you to have pretty immediate success so far? Uh, honestly, it's the support from my teammates and my coach is more attentive, so he pays attention to every little detail. So you really know what you're doing wrong and how you can improve. And their encouragement makes you do like more at practice. You try a little harder and it helps you succeed a whole lot faster than you did in high school. It's a big step. Obviously you had a couple of indoor meets under your belt going into the conference championships, but I mean, was, was a gold medal, was that something that on your mind going into your first college championship meet? I had, no, I mean, I was just expecting a better time than high school, more improvement. Senior year, <laughs> but uh, as a freshman, right at the gate, it was it was a lot. It was overwhelming. It was I was happy. I was surprised. It was amazing. What um, you you lower, even you lowered that time to more this past week in the outdoor. Um, what do you feel like you're getting better at as a freshman season? More like execution. Where to use my power? Where to keep it low? Like run my own race instead of basing it off of others because. You really just need to stay within yourself or you're going to like overwork yourself or underwork yourself. Anybody that knows anything about Louisiana High School track knows that Class 5A, uh, some of the runners out of New Orleans and from the Shreveport Monroe areas, are they're going to offer some good competition. You had, you won a state title at that level. How did that help you going into college track, having succeeded on, on that Louisiana High School state level like that? It gave me like an idea of what I was going to like go into, who I was going to be up against, lots of times to look look toward, like what to do better in. Also, seeing them run, I get more from them. Like I understand what they're doing and then I try and like accommodate myself towards them. So you learn a lot from high school to college. Not as much as you would, you know, actually going to college, but it is, it's a big step and it's nice to have had that experience to come to college knowing what you should do and what you shouldn't do. So why, yeah. COVID obviously uh, canceled some high school Ooh. championship meets, canceled some seasons. Uh, how did you, you know, how did you get back to that form um, this, this year for indoor and then hopefully, you know, keep going for out? sophomore junior year and I'm really happy about it so I know I can get better and better because hopefully we won't have that happen again hopefully that's all over so yeah I'm looking forward to the next next season or this season the remainder of this season see what I can can't do hopefully mostly can do so yeah. you're not the only central Louisiana product that's having a good season Galen Lloyd on, on the men's side yeah. um, you know it's, it's they're a little sin of pride there when when you've got a couple of, of people from that area doing well Yep, it's nice and I've known him since high school so it was like nice to see him doing things that I didn't expect him to be able to do and he didn't expect it either but it's up he's up there he ran a 46 I believe in the 400 so, yeah. like this weekend as a freshman that's really good and I know we have another girl Taylor Shaw I don't know if you've seen her but mm -hmm. she's been doing real well too yeah. Is the 400 is that is that your favorite race is that your 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 distance or, or are you more of a, a two a two okay I'm, i mean i'm better at the 400 obviously yeah. but the two is the race i really want to be doing okay. the 400 is good training for that race though so i do appreciate the 400. megan shaw thank you very much <laughs>